Hey everyone, Agram Frost here, and uh, today I've got this really cool Lucario tin to open. Um, as you can see, it comes with a Diamond and Pearl booster and two EX series packs, which is pretty awesome. Uh, I found this at my local Zellers, so yeah, there's probably no chance of you guys getting one of these, which is unfortunate. But yeah, I went and found this, and I had some uh, grad money to spend, so I was like, hey, I'll pick up one of these tins. It was like 20 bucks, so. Figured I'd give it a shot. Um, I also picked up a Heart Gold and Soul Silver Meganium deck because that's the only one they had. Or, well, I got this at London Drugs with a gift card that I have, but this was the only one that they had. So I was like, yeah, sure, why not? I need some uh, Heart Gold Soul Silver cards anyway. So I picked that up as well. But we'll get into the tin because the tin is kind of the point of this whole video. Um, so yeah, I'd never seen these before. I couldn't find any online, but there you go. And uh, we got Power Keepers. God, I don't even want Power Keepers. But there's the Lucario promo. It is a Pop 8. It's kind of cool. Hopefully it didn't get... Yeah, it didn't get affected by the, the bending, the little tabs there. So there's the promo. Looks pretty cool. And unfortunately, I basically paid for two Power Keepers packs and a Stormfront, none of which I actually want to open at all. So that was kind of, it was a gamble, but uh, whatever, maybe I can get some good pulls. So, yeah, why not? So, let's see what we have here. We have a Shellgon, Electrode, Pupitar. That's really cool, actually. That has that's amazing artwork. Uh, Roselia, Duskull, Onyx, Stunky, Magikarp, a very cool Scyther Reverse, and a Cherim Rare. All right. We get some Power Keepers packs. But yeah, like I said, I'm not. Re I wasn't really too keen on opening these at all. In fact, Power Keepers is like the last thing I'd want to be opening. But you know, whatever. What can you do? Some more EX series packs. So we have Scott, Medicham, Sfeel, C Dot, Slackoff, Ralts, Omanite, Sydney Stadium Reverse. It's pretty cool. And an Altaria Hollow. Well, there we go. This is actually one of the hollows from the set that I wanted, so that, that works for me. I do have a sleeve right here, just uh, just for such an occasion. Alright, so that works. Put that there. Just adjust the lighting a bit. It's a little bit better. Oops. Why did I know I was going to do that? just knew as soon as I adjusted the lighting and knew it and went to pick up the pack, I was like, I'm going to knock over the camera, aren't I? And, just as I thought, I completely went and knocked over the camera. And this has two bendy cards, so probably another hollow. So we have a Sharpedo, Warp Energy, very nice. I like that card. C-Dot, uh, Slack Off, Ralts, Ominite, again, Machop, a Master Ball, Reverse, and a wall rainy axe. Sweet. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. That's that is an awesome looking card. Man, this is like the first old school EX I've pulled since uh Absol back back in the day. That was like back in February or something. That is very cool. I don't think I don't have any sleeves lying around. I'll have to put in one of the penny sleeves. So that is very cool. I haven't pulled a, an old school EX in a while. Of course we got the Altaria Hollow, so at least the Power Keepers packs came through for me. That's good. And, uh, and yeah. Well, that was, that was worth it. That was uh, 
20 bucks well spent, I'd say. Um, Zellers does have another one of these tins, so I might pick one up tomorrow. Now, tomorrow is Canada Day, so I will be uh, uploading the the, uh, con or the anniversary raffle um, announcement video tomorrow sometime. You guys will see it when you see it. And, yeah, um, really, really cool opening. So I'll try and pick up the other one of these tomorrow. And... I will catch you all later tomorrow again with pos with the uh, the first anniversary raffle as well. So hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you all later.